Hey, welcome back to the channel. In this episode, we're gonna try and drive the 8.6, so come along. So Jason and I, we did a bunch of work on this last week to try and get it to drive. Unfortunately, we ran into a little bit of an issue where the crank position sensor is losing RPM for some reason. Um, got a couple things I wanna try first, and then uh, as long as that goes good, we should be able to drive it. I gotta verify that the sensor is the correct distance and a couple things like that, and then it might just be a setting in the hull tech. Um, We'll figure that out, but hopefully we drive it today. So I was talking with my buddy Dusty and we were talking about some stuff and he was like, hey, you should check this setting on the Haltech. I know we've had a lot of issues with Subarus on links. It's the amount of voltage that the, the sensor generates. If it doesn't generate enough voltage, the um, Haltech or the link will not pick it up. So check this out now. Ready? Stays running, which is awesome. Obviously it needs some work and stuff, but uh, hey, we're getting there. Yeah, so now do a couple little things. I think we, I might try and drive this here in just uh, a bit. I know Derek was gonna come over. Um, maybe I can get, I mean, he can't really do too much tuning because we don't have a wide band hooked up. Um, it's, I have one, it's just not hooked up. Well, it might be a little bit of a sketchy drive, but I think, I think I'm ready. Um, can't find the, the nut for the steering wheel, so I'm just gonna kind of have to hold it on. Yeah, it's, it's, we're only going five miles. So, I'm gonna have my laptop on. I wanna make sure that we're monitoring like coolant temp. Um, can't, like I said, I can't really monitor the air fuel ratios right now because uh, I don't have a wide band put in, but that's okay. Let's just see if it uh, even drives decent. It probably won't, but. I want to put five miles on it today. I want to. All right. I haven't even tested to see if it goes in gear or anything like that. We'll find out here in just a sec. All right, let's give it a shot. So far, so good. I'm gonna zip tie you guys to the mirror. Sorry if that's uh, real close here, but it's a smile on it, huh?
four miles. That's so awesome. We did it. Five miles. Five miles. That, I'm ecstatic. Um, again, there's still a lot that needs to be done. Uh, this probably, I mean, maybe this is where we call this video because we can pick back up and figure out the other stuff. But we did it. It, it, it drove five miles. <sighs> Big sigh of relief. Um, big one, obviously, I need an exhaust. So I need to ask your guys' opinion. Do I build an exhaust or do I just buy an exhaust? Buying an exhaust will be faster, potentially cheaper, probably the same price. Um, building an exhaust is more fun. So I kind of am leaning towards wanting to build one, but what do you guys think? Um, that might be where I leave this episode. So um, if it is, make sure you guys like and subscribe if you want to see more of this, and we'll see you next time.